Hello everybody. Welcome to Mina Says on YouTube. I hope everybody is doing well today. I'm going to be doing a reading for the collective. A timeless reading. In a minute. I'm about to go live on Facebook, giving away free readings and paid readings. I do that every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at 8, which is getting really close. All right. Let's get started. Let's see what Spirit has for the collective today. I'm using my regular cards, the Gilded Tarot. I will be pulling some Oracle cards, but I don't know which ones those are yet. I will wait till the end, till I'm drawn to whatever deck has the message that you are needing to hear today. Right. I think I'm going to retire this deck soon. It's pretty beat up. It's been a long time. It's been riding with me. All right, here we go. First, we have the Knight, the Knight of uh, Swords. It's all about your mental energies, um, feeling confident. He's very brave and sure of himself because he's he's got the intellect. He's very very smart, full of wisdom, and basically, he's won that battle before he even gets there. Um, this is a court card, so it could represent you, somebody you know, or some part of you to call upon now. It's a very fast action card. Let's see what the other ones say before we put any messages for you on that, because it could change. The Nine of Swords. The Nine of Swords is also about mental energies. It's about having anxiety about something so bad you don't even want to get out of bed. It's hard for you to face. Um, you're just really struggling with this issue mentally. Um, and paired with this one, it could mean that your mind is racing. It's just racing. It's going. It's, And you can't stop it. Um, it has something to do with... Your heart, you see how she's covering her heart. You're very heartbroken about this. It's not a bill um, or something like that. It's more, way more deeper than that. So let's keep going, shall we? We have the higher arcana, the hierophant. This is all about tradition. It's about, um, it's about traditional law. There might be a court case coming up. Um, He's in the upright position, so, and the energies I'm feeling with it, it it's going to go your way. It's definitely going to not solve your anxiety or your heartache, but it is definitely going to be a good outcome as far as the, the legal part goes, okay? I'm going to leave it at that for right now. Then we have the Eight, the Eight of Wands. This is a very fast action card, very passionate, um, fiery energy. This is about knowing what you want and 
throwing it out, launching it into the universe and letting the universe help you as you take the action steps needed to accomplish whatever it is that you're wanting. Um, kind of a wish come true type card. It's very fast. It'll happen for you really quickly. Make sure it's what you want and just hang on because it'll be a wild ride. And then we have the Five of Pentacles. This is a challenge card, a challenge card that brings the greatest amount of growth and knowledge when overcome. This one in particular is about dwelling in the issue, whatever this issue is, whatever is breaking your heart, you are focusing more on the problem than the solution or then the end aspect of it. You're kind of stuck in the victim mentality. I, yeah, the victim mentality. And you're not able to see past that. This card is urging you to, to do just that and see what resources are out there to help you accomplish getting the resources or the the help you need the it maybe it's therapy i don't know if it's grief counseling or just trying to heal old traumas most likely those old traumas are what's keeping you from moving forward is not, I don't want to say as quickly as you could, but from moving forward like you normally would be able to if you didn't have those traumas to heal. Um, there's definitely, definitely something going on within your heart, your heart space. See this woman? She's broken hearted. And she just cannot get past what she's lost. Whether it be money, family, um, a husband. Whatever it is. But there's resources out there to help. Whatever it is you want to overcome. This card is definitely saying launch it. Please ask for help. It takes courage and bravery to ask for help. Don't ever let anybody else tell you differently. The legal part of this issue is going to go in your favor, but it isn't going to solve your problem. It isn't going to make you feel any better. And that loss is still going to be there. And... You have the wisdom. You have the, the wisdom. Where's that owl? Right there. That represents wisdom. To face this problem and head on and overcome it. Um, another card with an owl full of mental energies and wisdom. It, Yeah, try and slow your mind down and take a step back. Pause for a moment. I don't know what it is that you're going through, but I feel it's very, very heartbreaking, very sad, and very hard. Take this time to heal, but do that. Heal. Don't, don't stay still, okay? Thank you. I hope all goes well for you. Have a good night, and we'll see you again another time. Please like, share, and subscribe.